with Disney Card Toys here and today we are going to make ourselves a beautiful flower garden using this Play-Doh set from the 1990s. This Play-Doh set includes two planter pots and even this planter card. Plus you can make four different types of flowers with these two molds. The set includes eight stems and at the top of each stem are different animals like a ladybug, butterfly, worm, and caterpillars. We are going to start our Play-Doh flower garden by making a beautiful bright pink carnation. Just load each side of the mold with pink Play-Doh and then press the stem in the middle. Close the mold very tight and then open it up and now we have our beautiful pink carnation. Let's now rip off all the extra Play-Doh and this actually comes off pretty easily. And now we can put it in our flower pot. The next flower I'm going to make is a daffodil. I'm going to load the molds up with purple Play-Doh and stick in a butterfly stem. Press the mold tight together to connect the flower pieces. And here it is. I don't know about you, but every time I see a daffodil, it reminds me of the flowers in Alice in Wonderland. Let's put this beautiful purple daffodil in the flower pot. The next flower I'm going to make is a daisy. Just make a small yellow circle and put it in the center of the flower and then on top of it put the white play-doh for the daisy and then insert a stem close it up squeeze and here's our daisy just clean up the flower and then we can put it in the flower pot Since we have two pots and eight stems, we're going to put four flowers in each pot. So this will be the last flower in our pot, and it is going to be the traditional red rose. I just tore off all the extra Play-Doh, and now we can add this final flower to this flower pot. Our first flower pot is complete. In the comment section, let me know which flower is your favorite, the daffodil, daisy, rose, or carnation. I think in this bouquet, my favorite is the red rose. Now that we are done with the first flower pot, we can move on to the second flower pot. I'm going to now make a pink carnation with a purple center, and I'm going to use the green caterpillar stem on this flower. Just squeeze them all together, and here's our beautiful flower. Play-Doh rips off really easily on this one. Now let's put it in our pot. It's really pretty. Next, I'm going to make a pretty unique looking daisy. I'm going to use a green circle of Play-Doh for the center, and then on top of it, add blue Play-Doh. Now here's a look at our beautiful green and blue daisy. The third flower that I'm going to make for this flower pot is a purple rose. This is my sister's favorite flower. Here's the purple rose out of the mold. It looks really pretty. The fourth and final flower that we're going to make for this pot is an orange daffodil. Here's our daffodil, let's add it to our pink and purple pot. Here's a better look at the four flowers that we made in the second pot. I think my favorite one is the blue daisy. What's your favorite? The last mold that we can use today is on our planter card. I'm going to first make an orange tulip. Just press the mold into the play-doh and rip off all the extra play-doh. And now we have a tulip. Next, flip over the planner card to make a daisy-shaped flower. My favorite flower colors are orange and bright pink. So on this planner card, I'm making my two favorite colored flowers. And here's our daisy. 